function. Need input. Okay, this is not the norm, as you would say. Never met Norm, but here he's a good guy. But I got a load dropped off to my house. Um, it's actually a customer that's dropped off some stuff to the shop before. And I know where it came from, and I know it's dirty, and some of it's nasty. But there's a lot of cool stuff in there, so let's put it on our cool black rubber gloves. And uh, dig into this. See what we got. I've got my garbage and recycling bins out there. And uh, it's nighttime in Florida, raining, nasty, floor's wet. But I got my gloves on, feel special. And we're gonna go through this stuff, see what we got. So, uh, got some keeper bins over here. So, let's see, first up, Earthlink 3, network interface card. The box has been opened, but I know the card's still in there. I'll give you a little history. Um, stuff we're going through right here, camera focus, camera focus, there you go. Boom. Stuff we're going through right here is from a house clean out. The house was purchased and all the stuff was still in here. The owner of the house, the previous owner, the now deceased owner, was a programmer in the 70s and 80s and a college computer professor. So a lot of stuff I've been getting is actually beta software. Um, a lot of 3.5 disks, some beta software. Look here's MS-DOS 6.2 upgrade. It's been open, but we'll keep that. So. Uh, Bam. What do we got? Encarta, not interested. Class action, something, something, something. Powerful collection of Windows objects. Okay. I guess it's an API access. Total access analyzer for Microsoft. This is sealed. Unopened, so we keep that. Boom. What do we got? Another total access agent. Not interested in that. Alright, so already. That container's out of there. Ooh, I see something down there, but uh, let's go. What do we got? See, this is what I'm talking about. Microsoft Windows NT Workstation version 3.5 Beta 2. Finding a... Focus! Finding a lot of beta software in here. Um, you'd be able to read it if my camera was not evil. Anyway. Okay, that's keepers. I've been keeping all the beta software. I have containers and containers full of it at the shop. And I, I don't know if it's worth anything, but hey, why not? Here we got a bunch of 3.5 discs in a dirty container. We'll keep the discs. We don't want the container. All the 3.5 discs and software I've just been keeping and uh, stacking up. I'll go through it all eventually. Um, I don't see the bottom of this container. I can always use software containers, but I don't see the bottom of that one. So, recycling. Okay, what else we got? Uh, some sort of wiry, hangy thing. It's metal. Uh, any scrap metal I always come across, I leave on the side of the road. There's a local scrap guy that comes by all the time and picks stuff up. He's cool, so I leave stuff for him. Fox Pro 2.0 for DOS, one of eight setup. So just stuff like this, a lot of programming software, beta software. What is this? Priority Mail. FMS Inc. Oh, look at those cool old stamps. You could look at them if my camera would focus. There we go. And as you can see, a lot of these packages and stuff is really dirty and nasty. But uh, hey, why don't we... Uh, Still taped shut. One handed. What do we got? Oh, my messenger's going off. Somebody is messaging me. I feel special. Total access code tools. Okay. It's sealed though. That's kind of cool. Um, usually a lot of cold to code tools stuff I'm not keeping, but this is still sealed in the box. We'll keep that. This goes. Recycling. Probably won't show everything because I know this video would be 10 million years long. Um, nice long antenna. Um, got a few of these at the shop, but I could always maybe possibly use more. There's the bottom of that disc tray, and we don't want that. It's dirty, it's nasty. We've got a million of these. Recycle. Like I said, I'm not going to show um, everything. 
it'd take too long. So uh, I'll stop this video and start going through some stuff and I'll show you the highlights. How about that? Alright, the bottom of that box had some random things like a GE KVM switch, audio video switch, a first alert smoke alarm kit, brand new in the package, probably from uh, mid 90s. A um, bunch of wire, but some of that wire goes to this, and this is cool. Automotive test meter. We're testing many things automotive. I've had these before. They come in handy. Luckily for me, they don't come in handy for the new vehicles you may own, but they come in handy for things like Betty White here that I own, or the Porsche here. So, uh, that's pretty cool. That can be used. Some of the cables for it are in there. There, 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 they're in there. Maybe missing some stuff, but who knows? What's this? Quark 3.3 Mac. That's cool on a zip disc. On a Macintosh zip disc. Keeper. I keep too many things. Digital voice recorder from somewhere for four dollars and ninety-eight cents. It's kind of cool. It's sealed. Oregon Scientific. Brand name. Okay. Keep that. Oh, well, crank batteryless lights. And it works. That's annoying, but still cool. Scan. Reset. Scan. Reset. What is, what is, what is scan and reset? Scan, what? Scan reset. What? The light? Oh. It's called Z-Radio. Turn Z-Radio up. And we scan. Oh. Uh, wait. Aliens. Aliens. Okay, that's just getting creepy. Um, seems to work. Maybe I just gotta wind it up, have more power for the radio to work. Uh, here we go. 200 watt Frontier car audio amp. That's kind of cool. We'll test that. Old soldering iron. Can never have enough of those. More paperwork. Uh, Windows NT workstation beta disc. But yeah, it's pretty cool. It's got a latch and thing on the back. Oh, look at that. Here we go. There's some stuff. We love stuff. Let's uh, get this situated and we'll show you the stuff. Alright, live unedited unveiling. What kind of stuff is in this stuff? Instruction stuff. Crumplier instruction stuff. I see the word Sears. I am not surprised. This is probably a Sears unit. Many of these that I've gotten are Sears or Tandy Corp units. No, that's for something else, but who knows. Cool. Some tools. And let me just uh, spill that all over the floor on purpose. I did it completely on purpose. A box of circuit breaker, wrench, that's cool. And I spilled stuff all over the floor. <sighs> Let me clean that up. Alright, you finished sorting it. There wasn't much to see. Random wires left over. Other wires will go to the shop. This is the keeper piles. Um, some wires and uh, some Game Shark. Uh, Game Boy Pocket car adapters. That was kind of cool. Old Packard Bell Mouse. Old, another old Packard Bell Mouse. Some random things. And of course, that car tester and things we showed you earlier. Um, also, four new in the box React wireless dance pads for PlayStation 2. Now, I'm not sure what those are worth. Cool thing. Have not gone through it yet. Just pulled it out, set it aside. Looks like we got a pack of Game Boy stuff here. I don't think there's an actual Game Boy in here, but still. What do we got? A chrome Game Boy case, and actually feels like it's metal. That's kind of cool. What else? Uh, there we go. Pokemon Crystal. Cool. Spider-Man 2. That's cool. 
Dragon Ball Z, that's cool. KO the Kangaroo. Uh, Rebel Star Tactical Command. Um, this is a part of one of the Game Shark Game Boy Lights. Um, put that there. Here's a Game Shark secondary battery unit. There. Don't know what kind of battery it takes or how it charges exactly. Let's see. Anything in the pockets? Empty, empty, empty. That's empty. So, what do we got right here? A random glove. Okay. That's a little strange. Um, there's one more game in there. We got Final Fantasy Dawn of Souls. That's cool. And uh, no more games. Oh, more games. Pokemon Gold version. Daddy, hey, Aurora. Are you doing custom time? Oh, you're doing LPS stuff? That's awesome. Guess what? I, I found I found some Game Boy games. Hmm? Final Fantasy Advance. That's cool. Hold that one. What do we got here? Elevator Action. That's weird. Are these games? Yeah, they're games for a Game Boy. Wait, are they supposed to go in like... Dungeons and Dragons. Are they supposed blurry. to go in DVD things? No, in a Game Boy. I don't know what you're talking about. That one. I'll, I'll show you. I got some at the shop. I'll show you them. You got Game Boys at the shop? Yeah. Are you fixing them? That's cool. Of course. You you should really sh um get... Frogger. Bring some of the Game Boys here. I should bring some Game Boy home? Uh-huh. And put some of these in there and sh show me how the games work. That would be cool, wouldn't it? Because I don't know Super how Mario Advance. <gasps> Mario! That's awesome. I, I've been waiting for Mario. For, oh jeez. Oh jeez. For twenty. Years. Castlevania classic. For you've been wait you wait wait you've been waiting for Mario for twenty years. Yes. You're only six years old. I know, but I wanna do it. You love Mario, okay? Let's see what else we got? One more game. Golden Sun. Don't know what, what? that is. And last but not least, Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Man's Chest, Captain Jack Sparrow. Ooh. That's pretty cool. Okay, I'm going to custom my OPS as okay. a unicorn. That's going to be awesome. You want to say bye for the end of the video? Bye! What do we tell people? Comments down below if you like this video. Good job. Bye! High, high five. <laughs> How about high five me? Yeah, there we go. All right. Bye. <laughs>